hello guys welcome to or welcome back to my channel today i'm so excited to film this video this is like right up my alley but today i'm going to be filming like a weekly reset for you guys everything i do on a sunday to prepare myself for the week ahead so i was thinking about it and i've kind of sectioned this off into three sections so the first being cleaning my room bathroom cleaning my space getting it ready for the week ahead doing a weekly grocery shop and then planning my week like in my diary for the following week so that i into the week knowing what's happening so yeah i'm going to start with cleaning my room my room itself is pretty tidy but like vacuuming cleaning my wardrobe a little bit and then obviously cleaning my bathroom but first step i actually have a pile of clothes that have been sitting on the floor in my wardrobe for the past week i'm going to get them right now i am so excited for this i've been waiting to film this so that i could actually start wearing these because i don't want to get them dirty but princess polly have sent me a hope of clothes for me to do a little mini haul for you guys so thank you so much princess polly i do have a discount code for you guys as well so i'll pop it on the screen and down below in the description box which is just emma polly 20 for 20 percent off site wide but i while i have this here i'm going to do a little try on haul for you guys i'm like i'm so excited summer is coming it is pouring down with rain outside today but summer is coming i'm gonna do a little try on haul i've got like quite a bit of stuff here so uh let's go okay i have rearranged my room ever so slightly just so i can give you guys like a good full length view of what's happening here but, but this is the adello mini dress in brown and i'm wearing it in a size eight it is obviously a gingham pattern it's so cute it's like shirt across the front and then it's got the nice big sleeves and it's actually a really nice length but on the back it's really cute it's like it's not open back because you can you can still wear a normal bra with it which is game changing but it has this little tie on the back which i think is really cute next up we have this dress this is uh, i probably should have left the best to last i think this is probably like my favorite item out of everything that i have here to show you guys today this is the recycled polyester tasman mini dress in green i'm wearing this also in a size eight i just love this like it's so summery i love the color i love the pattern i love dresses in the summertime because when you're choosing your outfit for the day you don't have to think of one thing you don't have to think of like a top and then a bottom and then get them to match the work is done for you i love this all right next outfit i love how like bright and summery this is this top is the goddess top in size eight i love like the one shoulder situation it's very cute and it's not obviously like that the detailing of like ruches on the sides like very cute these are the elite shorts and i've got them in a size 10. they've got like the little rips at the front i've had these in my wish list on princess polly for probably over a year and i am so stoked to finally be wearing them they also have like the, the princess polly denim patch on the back as well i love that detailing and the belt as well also from princess polly this is the nadine belt hang on let me just take it off so i can show you up close how it looks this belt is part of the earth club and it's got like the crop pattern on it and it's got like the gold details i find with belts a lot of the time like i have to put extra holes in them to make them fit but this is actually made to be like the right size so love that i'm pretty sure i got it in like a size small slash medium i just love this I, this this to me this is just like summer's coming it may be pouring down with rain outside but summer's coming okay i love how much color this haul is adding to my wardrobe but these are the havana shorts in size eight and they're like a waff not waffle they're like a ribbed material um they've got pockets they're so like nice in summer i was thinking these are gonna be perfect like day at the beach like slip them on like over your toes or something and this is the organic cotton wild eyes top in black i love this i love the neck like the neckline on it and like the length i have this thing about showing my belly button i don't know what it is but i just don't like it but like with these shorts that are high-waisted then like you don't have to see the belly button you know but honestly this like it just keeps going next outfit so keeping with the same top we have these shorts so these are the a brand la blues high relaxed fit shorts i got these ones in a size 10. i love the wash of these shorts i don't have anything like in this darker wash so it's really nice to switch it up but yeah just i mean classic denim shorts i love the length of them as well i like how they fold over as well but also with this outfit i have this little jacket shacket throw over deal this is the ryland shirt in size eight i love this it is like a cord pattern my mum's gonna be watching this going emma i would wear like something like that when i was your age it's okay mum. obviously you can button it up and wear it like a shirt as you can wear like a jacket again with this like with the havana shorts i thought this would be really good in summer like a throw over for like something like this or like a bikini or something it's really light and so you could get away with wearing it in summer and not you know putting your face off this is the last item i've um taken a little bit too long doing this haul so i think we need to go to the supermarket because it is now like 11 o'clock so i'm gonna 
put a pause on my room cleaning and um, head to the supermarket. I have restored my mirror back to where it belongs. I decided to stick with the A brand LA Blue shorts and I just chucked on this tea, also from Princess Polly. I think it's called the Flower Me Tea. This has honestly been a staple of my wardrobe for months. I absolutely love it. Just a reminder, with the Princess Polly clothes, if you do want to get your hands on any of those items I showed you or anything else on the website, you can use my code EMMAPOLLY20 for 20% off site wide. Happy shopping, but... I need to go plan out what's happening for dinner this week so I can go to the supermarket with a plan of what I'm going to get. As a flat we all contribute money each week and buy our groceries for dinner together and then one or two of us take one for the team and go out and do the grocery shopping. So today that is Taylor and I so we're going to go grab the shopping list and um, go do some shopping. I just, oh my gosh I'm sorry you can probably hear Morgan. Sound we've learnt during lockdown, sound travels so easily in this house. Oh, I just popped this pimple, I really shouldn't have, but now I've got a little Rudolph dot on my nose. But anyway, we have this little sheet here where we plan out our dinners for the week. So you won't have seen this before, this is new. This is a sample for new meal planner coming to EJS Apparel and we write our dinners on it for the week. Monday night we have sweet and sour chicken, Tuesday mac and cheese, Wednesday bulgogi which is a Korean dish, um, Thursday pad thai and then Friday tacos and I don't know, I don't know what happened to Morgan's taco little list there but anyway. And then we just have like a generic shopping list on the bottom so we have toilet paper and vegetarian chicken. Taya and I are going to take this and go to the supermarket and get bits for dinner and also we have a lot of snacks currently sitting around the house. Um, it is. We filmed something really fun yesterday, which you guys will see after, like, the week after this video. If you think you know what it is, comment down below. Anyway, oh, actually, I have something to show you guys. Here she is. Hello, everyone. Here it's is Rachel. my surprise for you guys. <laughs> Rachel is back. She has returned. I'll, I'll let you explain. Basically, on the day of lockdown, <laughs> I was in Taranga. And so I was stuck in Tauranga and then I was like, I'm gonna lock down here. You were there for, like, planning to be there for one night? I was planning to be there for one night. Like, I literally got, went home for one night, went Saturday, and then Sunday there was COVID, so I was like, I'll stay here. And then I was like, I want to go back home, because I wasn't in my normal home. Like, this is your home. This here, is my like... workspace, this is my, where everything is, this is, like, my residence thing. Like your primary place of residence. Yeah, so I, like this is, so I like called the health line like three times to make sure that it was okay that I could move back home because I was going from level two because I was in Tauranga to level three. And they said, yep, all good. All you need to do is just prove that your primary home is in that address. So I did and I had that all ready. And so now I'm back in Hamilton for, I'm permanently moved back here and I will be here until the rest of my life. Yeah, pretty much basically until like, like we can all go home, like once alert levels allow us to do yeah. so. So everything was checked with the government and everything was legal and that was my highest priority was making sure that what we're doing was, what right. we were doing was yeah. fine and that it was within the guidelines, which it was. It feels like the house just feels like complete now. returned from the supermarket so we're gonna do some turbo unpacking because it is lunchtime and I also have to be on a call in like 15 minutes so normally it wouldn't actually no it's a lie normally it is quite rushed on a Sunday but yeah anyway time to unpack The next step we have is to clean my room. Normally this doesn't involve a whole heap because I do tend to like, if I use something I just put it back away, like I don't leave stuff lying around. So normally it's just like a vacuum and then obviously cleaning my bathrooms, like wiping down surfaces, cleaning the mirror, cleaning the toilet, all that fun stuff. So I guess this will be most effective as a time lapse. So I'm gonna stick you guys on the tripod. Let's go. My room is all nice and clean, so now it's time to do, oh I drip water on my diary. It's time to do the third and final step of my weekly reset, which is planning out my week ahead. So I do that in my diary, which looks 
like this it's from St. Balfour I am an affiliate with them but I did buy this myself honestly this diary like normally like you know when you're at the start of the year and you're really excited like got a fresh diary excited to use it this one I actually have used the whole year which I don't know if that's a testament to my own organization or to the usability of this diary but I think I think it's the diary we'll give the credit to the diary I just fill out my weekly spread I have a little note space habit tracking space and then a like path each day where you can put in like a to-do list or a schedule or whatever so I'll just go in and pencil in well not pencil write in the things that I have on during the week just so yeah when I open my diary I can be like okay this is what I have on today this is what's tomorrow and so on and so forth these are the pens that I use to do the job orange for appointments for which I have none at the moment because it's COVID yellow is for my church stuff which I do still have a bit of that stuff because it's all online now green is for if I'm going to the gym obviously not going to the gym that just means if I'm walking to the garage blue is for EGS apparel stuff purple is for social media and pink is for work and then I just have black to fill in like I don't know birthdays and stuff so I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, planning and then that'll wrap this video up so keep the time lapse is my week planned out literally only takes like five or ten minutes but it means that I can head into the week with an idea of what needs to get done obviously there's like a lot of spaces and as the week progresses I will obviously add more things as things pop up that's kind of how we're looking also have this little verse up here last week I had that one in there which obviously looks a lot more exciting than that but anyway, anyway it says every detail of our lives is continually woven together for good and then these are my habits I'm gonna be tracking this week so bed by 10 p.m bible twice a day drinking two or more liters of water playing guitar in less than an hour of it's meant to say social screen time no, my screen time is definitely more than an hour but that's how we're looking that does conclude this video thank you guys so much for watching hopefully this gives you guys a little bit of an insight as to what i do to organize myself for the week ahead if you made it this far in the video comment you know let's switch it up comment your favorite emoji i'm very curious to see what that may be but stay safe stay well make someone smile and i'll see you in my next video take note of like this tan line here that is from when I got sunburned December 31st last year comment down below who you think I look like yellow is oh.